jumping on. You guys, if you want to have something like just blow your mind, wait and watch this next video. <laughs> it is one of my absolute, absolute favorites. Um, literally, this is, it's unreal, <laughs> this next haircut. I'm so excited. So um, she is a good friend of mine. We actually, she cleans my salon and I trade her hair and we are just really good friends. Uh, go ahead and watch to the end, you guys, and watch her reaction. I literally was going to cry and may have shed a few tears just because this is why I love my job is when I can take someone and take their hair from what it is and lift them up and cut it into something that looks great on them and makes them feel good and literally changes their look, makes them look younger, makes them look um, brighter, like lifted up. That is, that's like my dream come true. And that's what happened with, with my next client. And her name is Karen. And she seriously is, she is such a sweet person, hardest worker. I have ever met she is a hard worker um so watch the products that i use and watch from the the beginning of her cut because i leave it dry so you guys can see how it is when it dries watch the difference in how i use the products and what i use to make it look full and it, it's just gonna blow your mind i love it, it it's one of my favorite transformations so anyway go ahead and Watch to the end so you can see her reaction. It seriously melts my heart. But I will let you guys get watching the video. And again, thanks for your support. I appreciate it and I hope you have a great day. See ya. This is Karen and I adore Karen, by the way. She's such a fun friend. Okay, I wanted, I asked her if I could share this haircut because I have a lot of people ask about her hair type and what cut would be best for it. So this is a great one. I want to show you guys, that's why I left it, um, I mean, it's been washed, but it's just been, it, this is how it dries. Um, but I wanted you guys to see, like, the the feel of it. Um, it's fine and a little more thin, and we are going to make it look thicker and shape it. So I was telling Karen when we was talking, because she's wanted to change, right? Mm -hmm, definitely. <laughs> and so the last couple times she's left the salon, we're like, okay, next time. And then she's like, well, I don't know what I want. So she found a couple of pictures and they actually work absolutely perfect with her hair. So she did good picking the picture out. Um, so I wanted you guys to take a look at this. Um, like I told her, we are, it's like we're giving her hair a uh, hair lift. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna take all this bulk out here um, and we're gonna, we're not gonna really like A-line it, but we're just gonna come, we're gonna do a bob kind of here and we're gonna stack this so it gives this more body. And yes, we are going to do a little more layering up through here and a little bit around her face. That's gonna be really cute. And then she's just gonna be able to tuck her hair if she wants. And you love that, right? I do. And just have it really easy kind of here, just the lower ear right here. Um, so I just, I'm gonna go ahead and kind of wet this down a little bit. I just wanted you guys to see like what her hair was before, and then what we're gonna do. Okay. I told her she's not gonna be sorry, because she said she was worried. You know, everybody says, well, when I leave, it's gonna be hard because you make it look good when yeah. I leave. Regatta, Regatta makes it look great. So I know when I leave it will look great, but what about tomorrow? Yeah, she's like, what about tomorrow? So we're gonna go over the styling stuff really well with her. So um, I always like to look at their, their hairline and, and see where to go. We're gonna come up to her hairline. Um, we might want to take this off just a little bit with, with the trimmer, um, just because we want this back kind of short. Um, I'm going to cut this in, um, just so, I'm, I'm just gonna cut it so she doesn't really have to deal with the back, if that makes sense. So it's really, Stacked cute. Okay. Okay, now I'm lifting her, her head and just kind of going over. And you can see, see that thin? We're just gonna take this, we're gonna take that off. Okay, so just by taking that off, 
um, automatically that makes that look thicker. You can even see and it, it's wet. We haven't even put product or anything on it. So it definitely makes a difference um, just cutting those ends off. And that's what I mean like by giving it a hair lift. Um, she is going to feel like she's lifted, like serious. It's, I mean, that's just the word that I use. That's, I don't know, so many people, if I cut their hair like this, that's some of the words that they use too is, I don't know, I just feel like I'm lifted. I don't know. And so it's, it's just fun. But, and I did do before now, or before, so we can do after pictures too. So I'm really excited about that. Okay. Okay, now if we need to bring this back up in a minute, we can, okay? But I'm just gonna take it to here, and then I'm going to take this, just by the ears, I'm gonna pull that up. <clears throat> Hopefully you all are having a good day. We've had a good day, long day in the salon, but a good day, those are always good. Even with snow, right? Yeah, even with snow, yeah, we got quite the snow uh, this last, what, two days? Two it's days. been two days, mm -hmm. yep. So I'm going pretty tight here, okay? I'm coming about half inch away from her bottom here and then going out to three quarters and about an inch that way. Okay. And it's like I say, it's gonna be so nice to not have to deal with her back. Like, that will be nice. right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> you will love that. She's, so Karen, she is Miss Wonder Woman. Oh, no. And, oh, no. oh yes, give yourself some credit. This girl works and works and works some more and then cleans and then works and then cleans and then works. Anyway, so she needs something easy. Um, so I'm really excited. Now notice I pulled this back, okay? Um, I am gonna have just a little bit, you know, come behind her ear. And I'm, I'm thinking I'm gonna bring the length up a little bit here in a minute. But we're just going with it for a minute and then I'll bring the length up. It's kind of fun. You can kind of see um, when you start cutting into it where you wanna go with it. Like you just, you kind of can picture it, you know? Um, and I always like to, you know, just leave it a tiny bit longer if you need to, and then just come back in and obviously take it shorter. It would be cool if you could, you know, put it back, but you can't. So <laughs> I always like to leave it a little bit longer and then go shorter. Okie dokie. Now... And it's kind of crazy, you guys, because as fine as her hair is, um, she has a little bit of wave. Like, it it has a little bit of a curl with it. And I didn't used to. Really? Yeah. See, isn't that funny? Yeah. Yep, hair changes, and it is crazy what it does. <laughs> That's one good change, I guess. Or... Yeah, there you go. Then it, it gives you body. Yeah. <laughs> Oops, sorry, sweetie. I'm going to grab you there. Okay, now I'm just pulling this back here. You can see that guideline underneath. I'm point cutting. Same thing here. When I bring this back, you guys, and say when we cut the sides and whatever, and we want to take that a little shorter, then you can also. But I like to bring it back. Um, you know, it depends what haircut it is, but I like to bring it back just to make sure you are getting, you know, that length to fall in the front so you don't cut it all off and then wonder where it went. <laughs> so it's good to pull that back. And I just love it. So when there's, when there's thinner hair and more fine, it's so fun to watch it like, just take the the thinner edges off you know the ends oh man it just thickens it up and i don't know as a hairdresser that's like I, is that weird no that's amazing <laughs> like i love that. that you know what i mean you, it just ugh. you think taking off would make it thinner 
Right, yeah. Like a lot of people, that. yep. A lot of people are like, no, I don't really want to go shorter because I don't have, you know. Right, yeah. And really, yep, most of the time, it definitely looks like you have more hair. That's why I'm really excited um, to get it cut and styled. Because the style is really where you can see it, obviously, the end result. Okay. So you can see I'm just following her head shape, 90 degree angle here. And that's gonna nice be nice not to have all that bulk like on the top here. Right. That's gonna be nice. Okay. And you guys, I've been doing some fun giveaways. Um, I'm gonna be doing newsletters, um, tips, and sending those out. So if you wanna be on the email list to get any of my information on any deals that I have going, or like I say, any tips that I send out for the week, um, there's a link below and you can just click on that and, you know, put your name in there and email address and I will send out, um, an email to you with any, anything I have going on, which is fun. I'm going to be giving, um, 12 days of Christmas, going to be doing lots of drawings for that. So well, that's neat. Isn't, yeah. thanks. It's fun. I've done two giveaways, one yesterday and the one the night before. And so I'm doing another one tonight after your haircut. Yeah. <laughs> so it's fun, I just go live and do it on my website and Facebook. So it's really fun. So yeah, if you guys wanna be a part of that, go ahead and click on the link and fill that out and we will definitely send an email with all the info. Okay, you guys. Okay, now I'm loving the stack look here. Um, I'm going to bring the back up, which is good because that's, you guys can see, I mean, her ears there, and I was saying we're gonna kind of tuck it behind there. So you can see that length coming up to about there. And then we'll just take, um, the little trimmers and kind of trim that up. Oh my heck, this is gonna be fun. No, I'm excited. Good. You know, it's good for Karen too because she's been talking about it and like wanting to do it, but I love that she did take her time until she found something and was like totally ready for it, if that makes sense. Because sometimes if People just come in and they're like, yeah, just chop it off, mm -hmm. which some people are okay with that, but some are like, hey, what did I just do? Right. No, you know? I didn't want any regrets. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> so now, so see you guys, can, oh my gosh, it's cute and it's wet. So you can see how that shaped it up now that I took that length off. Um, that's what I'm talking about, the length. Like you can stack and then if you need to keep bringing the length up, it's good. But now, look how cute that is with that length up. It's super cute. Okay. Now, the front. Oh, Wazzy, I am excited. You are gonna, yeah, it's gonna be amazing. Super excited. Okay, now I'm going to angle up. And I'm not gonna angle up like a ton because we want her front kind of short, you know, and then just to be able to tuck in just behind her ear. So you don't want, this isn't gonna be a haircut to have big, long stuff in the front. We want it out of her face. You know, she doesn't wanna deal with it. She doesn't wanna, she's like, and this is a good, this is a good way to put it, like, cause a ton of people do this. They say, um, well, I just pull my hair out every day. So I do it and then I pull it up. Yeah. You know what I mean? And so it's like, yeah, if you're, if you're pulling it up, you might as well get a fun, cute style that's yes. short. That's, you know? That's exactly, because if every day I have to pull it up, and so I'm just tired of always looking like I'm at work. Right, <laughs> exactly. So <You're> like, you <laughs> don't want to do that. Plus, I think when you do a new cut, I mean, I don't know, it just makes you feel better. 
it makes you want to do it. Um, yeah, it really does. Okay, so I'm just pulling all of that length up. Okay, now same thing on this side. Plus, when you have shorter hair, it's fast, you know? So, yeah, if, if you, well, in this style, you won't have to wash every day. Um, you can use some dry shampoo and things. But, you know, this is a good style that you don't have to wash every day. You know what I mean? You can throw some, you know, dry shampoo in it and even some texturizing spray, like get the volume here and then you're good to go, you know? Okay, you guys, I'm gonna show you. So you can see this length here. I am going to come and take this off. See how that thickens that up even more? Oh my heck, that's gonna be so cute. See, she can tuck it. All right, darling, <laughs> getting excited. Okay, same thing, I'm gonna hold this side down. And bring the length. And you guys can see. See where I'm coming here off of that? That's where I'm taking that length. Show off that awesome jawline. Look at that. Okay. All right, now I'm just gonna come back here, you guys, and just kind of cut into this. So you can see that tiny little corner. I'm just taking that off so there's not so much bulk if she does tuck behind her ears. And that's what I said. Remember when I said, just hold it all back, you know, and then you have that length to work with. Now I just took a little bit of that length off, not a ton but a little bit so she doesn't feel like she has two globs behind her ears. So just come back up this way. Okay. Okay, now your side. So I took that length and then I took everything up and cut it here. Now I'm just gonna come through this way and just make sure everything is blended. See that tiny bit of a corner? And I'm kind of on an angle. Okay, so that side's done. Now we're just gonna come to this side. Okay, see that angle? Okay, all right, now, um, if you've watched me before cut, um, I told many people this, texture is good. A lot of people are scared of texture when they have fine, thin hair. Um, of course, you don't wanna go nuts, right? Like you would with somebody with thicker hair, but you definitely, definitely want texture in your hair. Um, that's gonna leave those shorter hairs underneath the longer hairs. It's gonna give it volume. I mean, Karen asked for it. I love, love it. it. I love it. I think yeah. it really does help. It really does. Yeah, even you know, having her longer hair, she'd always be like, "Hey, okay, the texture in there." <laughs> she likes the texture. Okay, now, like I said, sorry, I'm turned away from the camera. Here we go. Um, like I said, we're not gonna have it like hanging or whatever. We want a little bit of movement here through the front, um, and this is only gonna kind of thicken that up too, because you can see how these are a little bit finer and thinner pieces. So we're just gonna kind of come up, take these a little bit shorter, so she has like a little, little bang here. And then right here, we're just gonna take that, um, just so it's fun around her face when we dry it. So if she doesn't tuck it, 
It's not hanging, it's just kind of around her oh, face. Good. I like that. Good, you're good, thank you. And then right here, same, same thing on this side, giving her a little bit of like a bang thing here. Um, which this will be really cute with, like I say, her good cheekbones um, to come in this way. There. So anyway, a lot of a lot of people. I'm just gonna hold this out and take a little corner. See that little corner? Just take that baby off. Um, a lot of people. You know, if they want like an A-line or something, um, they like to leave the front longer and, and things like that. This is a really fun cut. Like I say, for thinner hair, this can be for thicker hair too. You just need to texture it more. But um, this is just a good way to make thin hair look thicker. Mm -hmm. And so, yeah, this is a really good style for that. So, that's what I did. I just... Hold those out, take that corner. Um, if we need a little bit more movement around her face, we can cut it in as soon as we dry it. But we're gonna dry first. Okay, so for thin, fine hair, or any hair that you want volume, you'll want a root lifter up here. Um, <clears throat> my products are on the link below. If you need any help or questions, just let me know. Okay, one squirt of Moxie Magnifying Mousse. Do not use more than one squirt or you're gonna fill it in your hair. You don't want too much of this. It's very concentrated um, and it will give you a lot of volume. Okay, then of course for um, the thinner hair and you want it to look and feel thicker, the thickening spray, phenomenal. But literally you're just gonna spray here, here, and here. That's it, like you don't wanna like ch -ch -ch like do not, it just has too much, it's just concentrated. So you just need like three tiny little squirts, okay? Okay, so after you put that stuff in, you're gonna just come back here, the back's gonna dry just kind of down, so you can just dry that down. Is that still get off your neck? <laughs> Good. She's gonna make, you're gonna shower and go, what? When you wash her hair? <laughs> Now Karen is one that doesn't like a lot of product in her hair after she styles it. Um, she likes it soft. Um, of course we want some volume through this top. So of course with the, the root lifter we're going to you know, dry the opposite way so you can get that full lift. But after I round brush it we're just going to create a little bit. We're going to put a tiny bit of the oil in it. Um, to help any flyaways, uh, it's gonna shine and it will also help with conditioning her hair. And then we'll just spray some hairspray. You know, we might back home it a tiny bit if it needs it, but with this root lifter, it's really good for people that don't love, they, that they don't, you know, so most people, um, if they're just like a soft, where their hair soft. They don't like a lot of stuff in their hair, but they don't like it stuck to their head. Yeah. So, you know, that's what the root lifter does. That, mm -hmm. That's what's really good about that. Because um, it can lift that hair, but it doesn't feel bad. It doesn't make it, like, extremely poofy. Mm -hmm. you, can, you can make it as poofy as you want, you know, with the root lifter, but... Okay, so I started about here with the round brush, okay? Mm -hmm. Um, I made sure it's about, oh, 80% dry. dry. Yep, yep, pretty much. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited. <laughs> this is so good. I knew this would be the best cut. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Okay, I'm going to turn so you guys can see what I'm doing. I'm just taking little... Don't look. Okay, um, I don't know. <laughs> I'm just kidding, I turned her towards the mirror and I'm telling her not to look. <laughs> well, have my glasses on. Oh good, so she can't see. She doesn't have her glasses on. So my lucky night. 
Okay, now if you're going to round brush, it's okay. nice to just pull up and try it. Okay. And hold it and then let go. And then let go. Yep, because that's really going to give you that volume. You guys, look how much thicker that looks already. Like, that's insane. <laughs> I'm so excited. Okay, so same thing. You're just going to come to your slide camera. Okay. On your bang, I'm going to kind of go forward. Mm -hmm. Not like you're going to have a straight bang across. Um, I mean, we're not going to leave that way, but kind of dry it that way. way. And then you're just going to kind of move it to the side. So that's going to give you that volume in front, but then you can push it to the side. And that, you guys, is good for thin hair. Um, just because some, some people will feel like, you know, they have this bang that's so if you kind of roll it forward, give it that volume, and then you kind of push it to the side. Oh, you won't need a rat. <laughs> you will need no back combing. Okay, so that just shows you what the, the haircut, the thickening spray, and that root lifter can do. Um, give it all that volume without like back combing or anything. Okay, now I do wanna show you two drops of oil. Now is that con to condition it? Yeah, the, it, it conditions it, it shines it, and it smooths it. Oh, okay. So if you have like any flyaways, um, it helps keep those down. Um, if anybody has static, it helps with that while it, um, which you can just kind of put this, in fact, I can kind of show you guys. You can put this oil in, See how I'm like pushing it down? Okay, so that's gonna condition while it shines and why it keeps all those flyaways. And then guess what? You can come bring your hands up through this. Oh, And look, it pulls it back out. <laughs> and then you're shiny, you're soft, and it's very full. All right, Karen, I'm gonna turn you to the, oh, you can't see. Let me grab my glasses. <laughs> oh, let me grab, yeah. Thank you, Ellie. All right. Okay. Dun, dun, dun. I'm excited. I'm way excited. Oh, yeah. And I can show you the back, too. Okay. <gasps> oh! <laughs> Do you oh like? Do you love it? I love it. Oh, I need to move. I just know oh, I need to get this wow. a tiny bit shorter. Wow. Oh. Okay, look how cute your face what is. I think I can't believe it. How right? Like that just... dun, dun, dun. Shows off her cute skinny face. No, I just can't believe that how it gave it so much volume. Right? Oh, my head. It looks I'm thick, excited. right? Oh, Sorry, I'm just taking you. this length a tiny bit on the side. You are very welcome. No, thank you. <laughs> We're glad, and I'm sure there's people out there thanking you too. Like, hey, thanks for doing the style, so I know it will look good. My hair's never looked that thick. Yeah, it. this looks That is thick. crazy. Huh. Oh, oh so my God. Okay. All right, you guys. Now, I will just spray a little bit of... I took this side a tiny bit shorter. Um, <clears throat> I'm going to spray it with just a little bit of hairspray. And I'm just so excited for it. Um, okay, I'm going to just... Okay, I'm just turning you around so they can see. It's so cute, oh my right? Heck, that's just... Oh my gosh. So, you, so I can do this, right? <laughs> you can do this. <laughs> you can do this. You guys, look at that. That is no back combing. No back combing. And you've seen how thin and fine your hair was. Yeah. I oh love it. Gosh. It's so cute, Karen. Oh my gosh. Thank okay. you so much. Yes, you are welcome. Unbelievable to get that volume. Right. So excited. Okay, so thanks you guys so much for watching. I'm going to turn her around one more time because it's just so oh, cute. Anyway, such a fun cut. I'm glad she let me show it. Um, look, it's still soft and movable. Um, and I sprayed it and I can even soft. Oh, that's right. so good. <laughs> good, good, good. Uh, so thanks again, you guys. And go ahead and come follow me over on Instagram. And it's Evolution of Verdana. And I would love to see you over there. And if you want to get on that email list so you can get any of my perks or my emails, um, tips that I do out for the week, anything like that, just go ahead and click on the link below. 
put your name and email and I'll send them out to you. So you guys have a good day and thanks again. See ya.